While saving water is key, our future might depend on developing new sources. That said, all eyes are on one California county. San Diego County, more than 30 years ago, lush green lawns, gardens, cool cars, the good life. But a water catastrophe was in the works. You can see the problem in our local reservoirs, or rather, it's what you don't see. From 1987 to 1992, California was hit with a mega drought, and San Diego was in deep trouble. In that time period, we had one source of water, and that was from Metropolitan Water District. Sandy Curl is general manager of the San Diego County Water Authority. She recounted how the region lost more than a third of its water for more than a year. It substantially affected the economy, the quality of life, and long-term economic viability in San Diego County at the time. Fast forward, and today, San Diego is riding a huge wave of success. Today, we use 43% less uh, water per person per day than we did in 1990. The county is not only more efficient with its water use, it has multiple new sources. A big one, the desalination plant located in Carlsbad, the largest one in the nation. The facility produces 50 million gallons of fresh drinking water a day using seawater. Serves sort of about 10% of the water needs that we have in San Diego County. In addition, some districts within the county plan to recycle wastewater into clean drinking water, thanks to top of the line technology. California's always had droughts, but experts say because of climate change, it's different. We're seeing a large increase in the frequency and severity of droughts and of water scarcities. Curl believes it's time we all change our mindset. I think at some point we're going to stop talking about droughts and we're just going to talk about our dry, hot climate, and that is the world that we live in. And when you look at it from that standpoint, you make different decisions. You make long-term investments. We cannot conserve our way out of dry hydrology. 